welcome to the second last video of the series. We will be talking about the status map and the dashboards within that XMS. Both of these tools are actually very useful to get a quick glance over either your whole infrastructure or select parts of it. So let's start with the status map. Status map can be run on any container within the infrastructure services. So for my topology, for example, I have a container here which is called all nodes, which simply has all the nodes that my NetXMS server monitors bound to it. And this is for a very useful reason that now I can do a status map on this container and it will actually show me every single node that my NetXMS server is monitoring and just a quick simply color overview of my whole infrastructure. So normally this would be very useful to put up on a monitor in a data center or somewhere else where just with a quick glance you can actually see if your whole infrastructure is doing okay or not. The status map can also be read on a container that contains multiple subcontainers, like my server's container here, for example, and that will actually separate all of the servers that are in there according to their subcontainers. And this can be useful if you want bigger separation within the status map. 